everyone. I'm Rudy Trujillo, sales manager of Calrad Electronics, and today we are going to discuss um, applications on the 92160 IR distribution block. It includes IR distribution block with six ports, and you could extend it up to 12 ports. A single IR flash and emitter, a dual flash and emitter. 12 volt power supply along with the IR receiver. Perfect for applications such as uh, extending it over um, Cat5 cable, Cat6 cable, putting this in a closet or a credenza where it's solid wood, it doesn't have glass doors. Now we're going to show you how this is going to be connected to the sources. So example, IR emitter is going to plug into one port, has 3M adhesive in the back of the emitter, and it's going to stick right on to the IR sensor on the DVD player, which is here. Certain sources have an IR sensor that's really hard to get to, so just a tip, you could use a small um, light, flashlight, to shine right in the front of the display, and you'll notice either a rectangle or a circular um, red, transparent little light emitter inside there, and then you'll know to stick the emitter right onto the front of that. Next, the IR receiver is going to be extended where the television is and it's gonna go into the IR receiver port. And this will be stuck to the front of the television to allow an IR signal to pass through the front room, TV room, over to the closet or the TV stand where your sources are. Next, we're going to demo how to extend your IR receiver that's included with the 92160 in an application where your television's 0 to 100 feet away. Basically, what you're going to do is cut the 3.5 off the IR receiver, and there's going to be three wires in there. There's going to be black, white, and red. You have to make sure that the colors are going to match accordingly when they are connected to the terminal block here. Black is your 12 volt DC, red is your ground, and white is your signal. Next, we're going to go into how to expand your 92160 block and incorporate it with an RTI XP6 or a URC MRF350. Taking the RTI XP6, it has one through six ports. An example, you have Johnny's room on port one, you have Kayla's room on port two. With Johnny's room, you could expand it up to 200 feet away and you can make your own 3.5 male to male mono with a cat5 cable so we're just taking an example and we're saying that this is going to be the 200 foot cable that you're using this is going over to johnny's room and the 92160 block is in johnny's room along with the individual sources that are connected there now, you're going to plug in the 3.5 male that you used into the IR receiver port. Now what that's going to do is allow you to take one emitter port and turn it into six or 12 in the individual room, which will allow you to have five more extra ports to utilize with whatever you'd like to program.